Hey, what's going on, guys? Warlord2033. I am back with a um, new Minecraft video, single player world test out that I found, and it's been on the forums um, quite a lot. It's quite a popular world, as I've heard. Um, I haven't tested myself yet, I haven't done anything. This will be the first time I'm testing it out. Um, I've just recently added the world to my um, world list, but um, it's a Nuke Town map, and Newtown and Minecraft, I don't know how it's possible, um, or why someone would even bother to build it, but we're about to check right now, so we'll just make that, there we go, oh, look at those frames per second, see, oh, that was instant, so that shows that, um, no lag on this, um, single player, so that's pretty top notch, um, oh, cool, I also made it the Newtown spawn area for, um, Spencer's, I think it was, so I'm in creative mode, so we'll just have a little brief overview before we get down to some um, killing here, because um, we always like killing people. We, they've made um, that double rainbow, that was a bit weird actually in COD, but anyway. So they've pretty much even outstandingly put everything in that usually you wouldn't be able to see. Like, we've never been able to get into that these houses at all, we've never seen them before. Um, which disappointed me in Nuketown Zombies because I thought we'll be able to actually get to them or Nuketown 2025. But yeah, they chose to have this little area again, just modernize it. Um, if I can find some Nuketown 2025 um, Minecraft footage, I will upload it for you guys. Um, see so they've still got the houses. Head. Skeleton. And last time I checked, I don't think there was a missile truck on there. I don't have to redo that. I mean, there may have been. I may just not focus on it. But, um, yeah, pretty much these guys put a lot of effort into actually building Nuke Town, I mean. That would take forever. Like, they got the windows in that here. They can smash. Oh, okay. So they're trying to make the mannequins with the heads. That makes sense, yeah. Um,. Yeah, it makes a lot of sense, actually. I was wondering what they were doing, but anyway. So this is a pretty good map, um, from what I've seen, but we'll do some PvP footage. Um, we'll test... No, there was no helicopter in this, was there? That must be just an add-on that someone got bored and did. Because last time I checked, there was never... Oh, it's like a care package. Chinook. Or as this would be probably a spawn area. They're yeah, probably good for spleef this game, maybe. I don't know. But um let's get down to killing some zombies. So let's um go find some people. Brain super secret house. Is there anything in there? No. Um, but yeah, these guys have put a lot of effort into it. I'm surprised. I mean, why would you go all this way to go and <coughs> make a map like this? I mean, I know it's absolutely terrific, but fuck, you must have been fired or left school early or something because you're a college dropout who wants to go and play Minecraft for the rest of his life. But fuck, this is pretty good. Most of this would have to be world well edit, but... Doing the mannequins and that, but the same as it is, it's probably they've not. But for fuck's sake, this is big. And they built sheds. Um, I, last time I checked, I thought that swing set was facing this way, but anyway. I don't know, these guys have done some pretty sweet work on this. Respect my authority! Fucking the creepers. They're probably the worst thing in Minecraft. Oh, uh, that's pretty top notch, actually. Oh, they've even built a sign that says Welcome to Nuke Town and the population. However, it's probably population one at this point in time, because I'm the only one playing. I'll probably do some multiplayer server videos on this actually, because this is pretty good. 
Big Tim's always uh, a good map as well. I used to like that. And Fire and Rage is my other favorite. So creepers do destroy on this map. Okay. This is he. Oh, what's that here? I have no idea what's over there. It's gonna have a little bit maybe firing range or something. It's supposed to be some guy's service, I think. And not really what it was actually. Because some of this stuff's pretty good. This is a Christmas village. Is there anything else on this server? This is also giving me ideas to myself as well, so this guy's lucky to do it. So this is overall, I rate this um, server if I was playing on it 10 out of fucking 10. This is amazing. They've gone, they've probably built a bunch more shit I haven't even found, but what I've seen so far, I'm pretty bloody darn impressed. Um. I reckon the people may they should keep it up because this is fucking amazing. Now, as for any other Nuketown disasters, we've always got to have some good old TNT explosion because give it the fact that it is Nuketown and Nuketown did blow up, so it's, well, yeah, this is top notch. Let's not um, destroy this place. Um... I don't know what it on single player. I'm just gonna. I'll just do a massive line across. With arm TNT. Oh no, it's not gonna answer that. That's probably gonna be big enough. It wasn't exactly the original Nuketown explosion, but I can't be bothered. But in the meantime, this now looks like Nuketown zombies. Um, so I'm gonna tell this what Nuketown zombies about. But um, oh, oh, there is a secret house. Didn't even know this. Right? Curry's room. Okay. I guess you could make this and sell the house in this for tons. But um, but yeah. Um, thanks for watching, guys. This is uh. A I s appreciate your um watching this dreadful video. However, on a good service, I don't mind it. Um, uh, this isn't so. Uh, I've just got a single player world off, but um, it's a uh, quite top notch actually, if you ask me. So um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, if you haven't already, consider subscribing because I'm a top notch bloke. Um, I'm not a prick that um. Goes on Xbox Live and does cops and robbers videos. Also, thanks for watching, guys.